Let me tell you why you're here. You're here because you know something. What you know you can't explain, but you feel it. Do you know what I'm talking about? Matrix. Do you want to know what it is? <laughs> So, hi everyone! In this video, you will get to know how does the golden ratio metric works. At first, after the purchase, the cell enters the common queue, which consists of 54 places. Any refills or reinvestments move the cell to a corresponding number of places. The cell purchased right after you increases the value of your own cell by 21%, regardless of who it belongs to. Then the other two cells bring it per 13% in profit, the next three following per 8, then 5 per 5, 8 per 3, next 12 per 2, and each of the last 21 cells will add per 1% to the deposit. In the result, the initial cost of your cell increases in 67%. In such way, your 6 tenths of BEP coin will be passing into the matrix with the cost equal to 1 integer and 0 tenths of BEP coin. As soon as a 55th cell appears in a common queue, it pushes your own cell into the first matrix, which is so-called X2 or an F matrix. The matrix X2 consists of 20 places and the cell falls into the first unoccupied position. The shift of the cells in the matrix is taking place in the spiral mode from 20th to the first place. The following cells from the queue one by one occupy the empty seats. After the matrix is filled, the participant who had the cell in the first place receives his first profit payout. Then the matrix divides into two. By dividing, the cell located at the first position in the matrix X2 moves into the matrix X3. The rest of the cells then start consistently occupy places in a new two matrices. After those two matrices are fully filled, it leads to a new division by three X2 matrices. In the same principle, the cells located at the first places on the matrix X2 move to the matrix X3. The rest of them consistently occupy places in between three matrices. Depending on the total number of cells purchased by all participants, such matrices can be divided from 3 to 5, from 5 to 8, then to 13, 21, and up to 233 equal matrices, all of them clearly in accordance with the sequence of Fibonacci's numbers. The final stage of the division is the formation of 233 X2 matrices, which are then divided into two blocks. Those two blocks, when filling, also divide on three and then five blocks respectively. So this is the end of the division. There can be no more than five similar blocks. Those five blocks received then form a microblock. A formation of five blocks in a microblock causes recursion, or other words, repetition of the process at a higher level. So each time a block of 233 X2 matrices is filled in, the system restarts again with the cells kind of being shaken and a new block is formed. This reallocation allows you to speed up the process of closing matrices with the new cells and ensure payments to the all project participants. So now we looked at the process originating from the matrix X2. From higher order matrices, all the processes are flowing in the pretty much the same way. If you would like to hear more about the project in English, don't forget to subscribe and use the links below to join our Telegram technical chat about the Golden Ratio project.